A lot of noises, flash shots, and maybe a few jump scares too. Okay, interesting. Hey. Okay. Hey everybody, this is your Blue Hoodie Plays, and today we're, we're playing Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. Now, get me wrong, I have not played this game before. If this screen is wrong, it is wrong, because because it's supposed to normally, it's supposed to, uh, n normally show the pixelated version, but I get, I was making, a a video ab ab about that, the, the first playthrough, until, until something happened, my entire PC. So, we, we're gonna be playing it in whatever progress it was. So here we go. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. Mm -hmm. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. I see. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. Uh, what are we not. talking about? Oh. We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. I see. That's right. Restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Hmm. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial None investment, you will receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. Uh -huh. Such as, atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Mm -hmm. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket ready for reinvestment. I see. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Mm. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. I see. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside oh. whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Oh my. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. Huh. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Hell yeah! Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Huh? What? What? What, what, what did that say? I don't know. Anyways, let's make some money! Money! I love money! Yeah, money! How to... How to a two-step guide on re restaurant management. Catalog mode, purchase items, and supplies. That's this. Google mode, plus items, upgrades. Okay, so it's like a uh, a a, uh, a idle game. If you've ever played, it's like those types of uh, idle games that some people play. Like where right, like you gotta place down stuff that that helps your restaurant or whatever. That's kind of what this is. Sure. Now let's get started. Yeah! Day one! Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great. That should be more than enough. A hundred dollars. let's get started. <laughs> On your left are your product catalogs. You and that was... unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. 
When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled Finished in Blueprint mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Ah, I see. So, as I was saying, this is like a tycoon type game. From what I'm getting at now. Where you, uh, where, where you place certain things that help you. So this is Dumpster Diver Weekly, Stan's Budget Tech, Smile, and Servos, and Rare Finds. So, if I can get from this, this, this is the cheapest one that we can go to for now. But later on, we're gonna be able to get, get these and get, like, better stuff. Like, like, actual robots instead of, like, trash. So, the first thing we're gonna, we're gonna get is obviously this. Because, look at it. Look at it. Entertainment and bonus revenue up, is, are up by one. That's pretty good. And, and look, we have like seven seventy dollars left. So seventy minus twenty. Uh, that, that, that's fifty bucks. So we can so we can totally get that. Yeah, of course. Because remember, we're we're trying to get the uh please excuse my stuttering. I'm not, not recording in a while. Anyways, mind mind this that we are trying to get the best the best restaurant there is. It may cost a lot, but shit, I'll take it. And, and with no risk, so all these are now up by one. Just from buying those. Single size for one animatronic. It's fine. You know what, we don't, we don't need animatronics right now. For right now, we can just like, if, if I was to get a stage, be like, the kids can be on stage and do whatever they want. They can sing, they can dance, they can do whatever they want on stage and anywhere else. C creating more fun, cause you know they're not limited to being everywhere, everywhere else but the stage. Like most, like most uh, robot uh, pizzerias are, well, were known as. There, there aren't any more of those. That I know of because I because I know Chuck E. Cheese is done for. I think it's I think Chuck E. Cheese is over with. Like, that's all in the past now. Speaking of that, I know I know you can't see it because I'm, my, my camera isn't set up right now. But I have a vintage uh I have a vintage Chuck E. Cheese coin wherever, wherever I put that at. But it's it's uh it's somewhere. I had a vintage, I had, I had a, uh, a vintage Chuck E. Cheese coin, right? And it's so old, it still has, like, old-ass cheese on it. At least I think that's what that is. I don't, I don't really remember what that, what's on there. But, but it's like, you know how pennies get dirty? That's kind of what's on there. I don't know what's on there. Anyways, enough about that. So, the, so we don't have to buy these right now because they, they, they don't have they don't, they don't really help help us at all. Health and safety, we, we we could totally get this. You know what? We can get this later, okay? Because these are these are up by one. Add that up. That's four. Wait, no, fuck that. Forget that. Forget I said that. But anyways, these are all up by one. We if. If I was feeling, feeling a little bit risky and I was a dumbass, I could have bought this and just had one thing with one possibly maxed out thing, but we weren't gonna do that. And now we, we can buy a $25 fan that, that put, puts these up more in very good condition also, so we can get that. Or, or, or we, could, we could go bigger and get this duck pond. Which upset the entertainment by a lot and our bonus revenue. So, at, and then we cannot get these. We can get these though for, for, for five bucks. So we can totally get these for five bucks. That's now from from our options. We can either buy this or this. Now don't get now don't get me wrong. But, you know, considering this, I'm not sure what season this, this takes place in, 
probably either in spring or the summer. So, why not get a fan in there? Because sometimes kids, kids, and kids are gonna be like, uh, you know, hot, sweaty, fucking, you know, because they've been outside or they haven't. That doesn't matter to me, but they've probably been been outside so long that they're, you know, hot as hell. So, we're gonna buy this fan, and then, and then we have 20 bucks to, to save up. That's my, that's my master plan. Now we can go over to boom, boom, boom mode to see what's up. Ah. Oh, 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 it's a disease. Okay. So this is our, uh, this is our blueprint. We have our fan. Our, our play pals. We can put things over here. We can put that there. Actually, no, wait, 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 actually. Move that. Now, guessing that the entrance is, is like over here, right? We, we, we can we can put it like over here. This seems like a wait. What happened? He had a fast rating whenever I did it over here, right? I guess I, I guess it just says that. So, anyways, we can put it over here. Then. Do they have anything else? We do not have any, anything else. I realize- I- I'm trying to realize they have so little. But that's fine. What, what do we have so far? We have this. We have... We have... Sold out. We have the- We have the, uh... Party cups. We, we've gotten those, so we can probably... If they're, like, on there. Ah, oh, they are! Yeah. They're on there already. So, we have... Everything we need for a starter thing. We got air conditioning, paper pals, colorful cups for atmosphere, bees too for atmosphere, and and free balloons for the children. Bam! Look at that. Atmosphere three, health city three, entertainment and revenue. That is how you start your business, people. Wake up, get your money up, not your funny up. We got opera. What's this? Fun? What is that? Uh, now, do, don't call me a dumbass. But I can. Uh, I have a hard time reading cursive. It's just. It's just. Well, I can read some cursive, but this is just. I'm gonna guess this is this is fun time. Fizz fizz time pop soda. Have a have a popping time with with fizz time pop. Oh yeah, there we go. Fizz time pop Inc. is offering to pay pay for advertising. I'm gonna guess that that you have to pay 250 for this, or or it gives you that. I was right. It gives you. I I, I was right. It gives you the freaking money. See, man, I'm already I'm already good. This is easy. This is fucking light work. Anyways, we're done now. We're done. We're finished with that. So, your restaurant is now officially open. Yeah. Awesome. That doesn't Whoa. mean your job is finished, however. Huh? You what? have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. What? From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, on to other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation ah! system in your terminal is pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there's nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. Uh -huh. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. So, I, I, I also, Xenex. shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. 
Now get to it. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day, and you can go get some coffee. I see. So first things first. Scam that bitch, first things first. I have a bad feeling. There is nothing there. Nothing? Okay. So. Oh, he's trying to zoom quick. Alright, so. We got order supplies, order cups. Wait, wait, wait. So Z, turn that off. And X, turn that off. I sort of got it. I could have swore I heard something like that. Yes. Anyways, that's already just comes to get the fuck out of here. It's creeping me out. All right. We're gonna one, one at a time, one at a time, and then just check afterwards. That might be a bad idea for future reference. But that is the only strat I have for this. Because, because don't be fooled. I have a bad feeling when it comes to stuff like this. Because I, 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 that, that, that pushes my sh it, that much to the roof. I don't know, man. Just something about it. Now we gotta do advertising. Oh, that's the printer. Oh my god, it's just the printer. Okay, thank god. I mean, the first night is usually never that bad in any of the games. I probably should, should not say that because Mark Parr said that and he got his shit rocked instantly. So I probably shouldn't say that. That's also against myself. But this is a, this is a, this is like the tutorial, so I'm pretty sure it's fine. The first day is usually never that bad in the games, except for except for FNAF 4. FNAF 4 will fucking kill you, like like no bullshit. You will get your shit rocked if FNAF 4 on the first fucking night. How do I know that? Because Markiplier did, and, and that made me fucking laugh my ass off. How long is it taking to, to, to print a fucking, uh, to print a fucking menu? How long does that take you, cuz? Like, do you need more ink in that bitch or something? Cause I can definitely give you some more ink in that if you need it. And that's done. Check these. Cause it... It does it while you're checking. I know, I know, it, it, it stops when you check. Okay, new strategy. You, you check in between downloading it, or fixing whatever it's called, whatever it is supposed to be going. Yeah. Yeah, turn that on. How bad can that possibly be? I did not just I I I did click on that. I did click on that because of what I did. That's nah, we're good. That's everything. Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. All right. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Okay, sweet. I'll, we couldn't... 
we couldn't upgrade anyways. And why? Congratulations and why, on completing your first day. What? However, your job isn't over just yet. There's another aspect to your end of day routine. Whoa! Is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often. And while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage, or if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Nigga, nigga, I'm not keeping this spaghetti looking motherfucker! Um, Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. Sweet. Lawsuits. Look at that. Food revenue. 220 Look at that. Five hundred dollars. We made five hundred dollars. We're getting paid the big bucks. We do not need that spaghetti with a motherfucker in our restaurant, guys. We don't we don't need that nigga in there. I well well we're not showing it anyways. That, they're not gonna be sold in, I mean, showed on stage. Well, we don't have one. But think about, think about it like this. Think, think, think about it like this. Some people host host birthday parties in places where there, where there are no animatronics of any kind, not none, and they make big bucks. So, so we are not going to have that. As parts, because, because first things first, we don't we don't have a stage, so why keep it? If we if we have no stage, why why keep it? Second thing, second parts for what? Well, like I said, we can make the best restaurant ever with no animatronics ever. So case in point, with that in mind, entertainment. The liability risk. What could possibly be made as tiny as ball pit? We have to have these already. We're not getting these. We can get these. We can get this now. Well, we got a new catalog. What's this? Ooh, look at that. We, we got new stuff. Enhanced speakers. Damn! We can buy this too. For atmosphere. We can totally buy that. A fruity maze arcade. Marked it down. Well, marked it down. Well, well. Purchasing a bulky item in this case comes with a matter of some sort of desire. Hide hiding inside? Like what? Like what? You get. Like what? This is not. This isn't like, um. Th this isn't like Walton Files where I show literal dead people on screen. It, it can't be like that. But at the same time, I'm not gonna buy that, cause, cause you know, I, I'm smart. Work smarter, not harder. We're not buying that. We can totally. You see this? Look at this. Three bonus revenue. And look at the price. Give, give me that! Yeah! Give me that shit! Hell yeah, bro. March down. 
Oh, look at that. Here are the here are the real animatronics. Look at these guys. Look at these guys. I'm not buying that either. But look at this, Mr. Hippo. This guy is is, is possibly the nicest the nice animatronic. The, ni the nicest one in, in the entire FNAF verse. All he does is tell stories. Like, he just tells stories. He, he, could, be like, he, he could be like a story time person. Like, say, like, say I was just like, again, excuse my stuttering. But, because I'm really, I'm really hyped up. But say I was to like buy this animatronic, right, and put him on stage. This guy could just like tell stories to children. Like he could, like he could create his own world, imagination. They could, and th and he, he could really make the make the kids feel like he's actually in his world. He's this man is like Forrest Gump telling his stories, but but they aren't that bad as they seem in the movie. But they aren't that bad. This guy is real, just just for just Forrest. This, this, this guy is just the Forrest Gump plot. It reincarnated. I wouldn't. I would not know because I don't. I don't. I didn't watch Forrest Gump, so I wouldn't know. So don't quote me on that. Anyways, we're getting sure. Wait, 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 wait. What else can we get though? Wait, let's see what we can get in here first. We can probably get some good stuff in here. We ain't got that. Uh, unavailable? Gee, I wonder why, because it's just, it's, it's, it's just fucking, they, these people. But, but enough about that, we are totally gonna buy this. A foil party set. We're, yep, we're getting that Chuck E. Cheese-esque thing. Like, like, you, you would, you would put the, the most recycled pizza known to man on those plates and, and then drink coke from one of these cups while, while, while wearing this, just, just, just watching the TV instead of just fucking watching the actual like, robots do their thing. It's just something about it, man. I think I'm getting nostalgic. It's just something about it. Anyways, we can also get these for 90 bucks, so we can also, we can also get that. And then, and then any, anything else over that is kind of like, I don't know. We could possibly get these, but, but, and, uh, and this one just jacks out our atmosphere. So, so I could have bought this to jack our atmosphere out a little bit. I also could have bought this because, you know, you know, it's a video game. And, you know, kids in the 80s love video games, or, and the 90s, that literally revolutionized most of it. Uh, children nowadays. Video games, I'm not, I'm not saying they ruined people, no, because I'm playing a video game myself, so I wouldn't say they, they ruined it. And they don't really, they don't cause violence either. Unless you're like a Fortnite kid, then, then it definitely causes violence. <laughs> but, but like, case in point, the people who, who play video games are like, like the children, you know what Like, half of the game community is like, chill people. In, in like, their or so. But anyways, that's all we're gonna get for now. Let's see how it looks. Let's see how it looks. Looks nice. Oh, Ooh, wait, look at that. We got lights, but no stage. I didn't. I didn't know the lights were for the stage. I had no idea. I, I had only gotten those because it because it you know a adds up all this. 500 bucks? Man, if y'all give me that! Look at that! L look at Marty, bro! He he stands up! L what is the Mario wannabe? We have we have nothing to put here right now. So and since since we have six hundred dollars, we can we can now get the game. We can get this. So we gotta go back go back here. We can probably use mouse to it. No, okay. We, we can definitely put this here in the game. Put, 
We can definitely put that in there and do a play test. Play test? Sure. Sure. Oh, it's, oh, it's timed. Yeah, uh, yeah. Let's just do a play test. Also, my friends might call. Oh, oh, who's that? Whoa, who, whoa, who's that? Who's that? Anyways. Uh, I'm not sure who that is. Oh! Whoa, 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 who, who is that person? Who are you? It's, 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 it's a rabbit. Yes. Speedrunning. Who are you? We're being stalked by a rabbit? Uh, kinda? That kinda sounds familiar. Being stalked by a yellow rabbit kinda seems kinda seems familiar. Oh, what are you? What? What? Oh, he went through walls! Yo, that's so fucking awesome! It can walk through walls! That's so cool! What if I was just, just like touch the rabbit? Let's see what it was up with that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, bro. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh! That was great! We're keeping this! That actually made, made my adrenaline go up. We're definitely keeping that. Hell yeah. We're keeping that game. See, I know what I'm talking about. We're keeping that game. If we can never get this, we can get that boost the atmosphere up by, by like a gazillion. See what it looks like? This is gonna be by the stage area. Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, I fucking knew it. But, but look at that. But look at our atmosphere! Look at that! It's- it's at 15! We got this! Our health and safety is at like 7 also, which is great. Which is great. I know what I'm doing. We got on the stage. However... But for what purpose? Oh yeah. We're not getting any animatronics. Not- not fucking one. So screw that. I know you people came here to see animatronics, but we're not- but we don't do that here. Call me a bitch, I don't care. I'm making the best! The best robot list thing ever. Cause, in any of these games, we know that in any of these games, with, with a robot in a pizzeria, that robot is cursed. We're not getting that. I'm not trying, trying to die from a restaurant. I'm not trying to do that, man. I would get this, but, but the liability is so fucking, fucking big, so we're not doing that. Also, I would also get, get these, and they are unavailable. Hey, hey. I, I would also get this guy, but... Oh yeah, we can get this too. We can get that also. Yeah. So I I think I'm spending a lot of time in, in the, this. We can buy the ball pit, but in in the ball pit game, Lefty snaps his neck. And that's probably that's probably why this is on here, because you know, neck get your neck slayer or something like that. I'm not sure how to get these. We had gotten these by buying stuff from in there, so, so if we were, we were to buy... I guess the only way to get to these is to get a robot, but we're not gonna do that. We ain't doing that, for obvious reasons. So, we, we have this here, right? We cannot put this near the machinery because it, because of, because you know it's water. So let's put it over here, clean and polish. Oh, oh, you can upgrade these. 
need to upgrade them. So you know what? Just to, you know. What is this game? It gives atmosphere. Oh! Once you once you do that, it goes away. So that's nice. We, uh, let's let's yeah, let's polish everything we have. So that's polished, that's polished, that's all polished. We're good now. So we're finished. We're, we're finished with that. So that's great. And, and I'm gonna say that. On, on to our second night. There shouldn't be anything wrong. Since, you know, we have no bots, so there shouldn't, shouldn't be anything wrong. Let's still, like, let's still check in between these. Also, let's, also, let's get a uh, motion detector in there and see what's up. Because now it's the second night, which, which is kind of, you know, bad things might happen. Like, it goes from never gonna happen to it's gonna happen. On, on like a scale. So, quarter utensils. And that's all for this. <laughs> Not to advertising. I swear to God, there's there's nothing there. There's absolutely nothing in there. So. Yeah, that's that. So it does, it does work in the background. That's nice. Good to know. When does this end? I guess it does not. Oh shit! Oh damn! That scared the fuck out of me. Wait! Shut up! Shut up! I'm being, I'm being paranoid. I'm being paranoid. Our goal here is to make the best pizzeria for, uh, for, uh, I cannot speak today. For people who have forgotten, our goal here is to make the best pizzeria known to man without without any casualties or any liabilities. That sounds like something a pro FNAF player would say, kind of, but no, no don't get me wrong here. In any, uh, never mind, never mind. Forget forget what I said. But we're trying to make make. Like the best pizzeria in in my image, and and that image is having no robots. If, if there were no robots, this would never happen. Matter of fact, if the Athen family had never existed, this would have never happened. Just, just not thinking about that. If Athen had never spilled his cum into somebody else, that would have, it, this would happen. And I believe that's it. Nice! That's it, that's all. Okay, this is gonna... Wait, wait. Oh, oh yeah, th th there's this part. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. Mm -hmm. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. 
Or oh, shit! You can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Oh, shit. Throw that shit back, bro. We know who this is. Throw that shit back, bro. No, Don't no, no, no. forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. So, throw that shit back, bro. We're not getting that. That that is literally just blew your mouth. We're not we're not getting we're not getting that. Seventy visitors. Food food revenue. Look at that. total revenue. Four hundred and fifteen dollars. Sweet, sweet. See, look at that. Now now it's pretty good. It's good now. Ah, wait, there we go. It's good now. What's in here? Whoa. Oh my. Oh, oh my. Oh my. Oh yeah, that's your friend. $900 for a ladder tower. Wow. These are all really fucking good. These are. These are, these are really good. These are really fucking good. These are, these are really fucking good. These are, these are, these are fucking good. Another thing, we're gonna have to uh, upgrade our, our floor pan. So let's upgrade our floor pan first. Hey, look at that! Look at that! And now we have more slots. A thousand dollars. Accept that. A accept that. Now we can place our uh, stuff. So wherever wherever it gets over. So now we can. How about we make this entire? Uh, that's not what I want. Sorry. That's not where, where I wanted to be. How about we make this side a like a, 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 a miscellaneous thing, and then and then make this side over here a gaming a gaming station. So we're gonna put we're gonna put this bad boy over here with the rest. Since it's like a game station now. We can also upgrade again, but we're gonna do that later. So this is this is this is a. Uh, since we have a thousand dollars now, we can probably get get some pretty good stuff. But with with things being cool and brand spanking new, it, it comes at the price of liability. However, this this doesn't have to be. This does not have to be the case. We have a bat. We, we have a basketball hoop for some real niggas out there who who are for the real NBA 2K fans. We have gotten the carnival hoops or or the basketball the basketball hoops you you, you would see like David Musters for the real 2K players out there. You are welcome. It, it, it is literally clipping outside the fucking thing. Yeah, yeah, po polish that bad boy. Four, four hundred dollars. We could, we could get one, one of, we could get one of those juicers. However, we, we are not gonna do that. Anyways, and now, look at that. This is our brand spanking new pizzeria in tip-top shape. No casualties. Everything is clean. It's polished. No casualties. And we're getting that bag. Saturday's gonna be a breeze. And and that there are no murderous robots about. Man, Saturday Saturday will be a breeze. Saturday's gonna be a fucking breeze, bro. It's gonna be lit. Anyways, that's it. For, that's it for this video. If you liked this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And you, yeah, you probably should you should do do, to do that. Like, comment, subscribe, so we can continue renovating this place. Because look, look, look at it, it's so beautiful. Every item is is, is speaking. We got a coin slot too, like a hundred dollars. You should wait, hang on. Just for just for some extra cash, because I like being a I like being, being a, a snob. But anyways, 
If you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe so we can keep working on our brand this big and new restaurant. And as always, have a wonderful day, stay blessed, and God loves you. See you.